Hi, this is BG Brooks with CUBuffs.com. Our position by position preview of the 2014 Buffs in training camp continues today with the defensive line, an area in which improvement is needed and expected for this season. A coaching reassignment last spring moved Andy LaRussa from cornerbacks to the defensive ends. That extra set of eyes and daily tutelage should benefit the Buffs in a couple of ways. First, it frees Jim Jeffcoat to work exclusively with the defensive tackles. Second, it puts LaRussa in position to offer more one-on-one -on -one instruction on the perimeter and find a replacement for end Chidera Yuzo Deribe, CU's sack leader last season. One of the things Jeff Coat wants from his tackles is a stronger inside push on the quarterback. Senior Judah Parker was moved from end to tackle to help facilitate that inside pressure. And Jeff Coat expects 300 pounders Josh Tupo and Justin Solis to pitch in on that pressure. I don't like to shy away from contact, so it's always fun when we get pads on and get to hit. You know, you can tell that a lot of guys are trying to, you know, be physical, you know, working on tackling and stuff like that. So it's been fun. Uh, just uh, getting some wins. You know, I don't like uh, personal goals. You know, I like to set a, a bigger goal, and that's for the team to get a W and win. So that's what I'm looking forward to. Go, go, go. Uh, so I think today was a really good practice. You know, we worked hard, we got a lot of things done, and uh, I think today was very productive. You know, it feels real good. You know, it feels good to get back and uh, banging with the offensive line. I think it's been, we've had like, a good couple of practices in full pads. Uh, I think Josh Tupo, he's been really stepping up. and I think a lot of the young guys, especially Jace Frankie, he's been doing a real good job. He's only a freshman, but he's uh, he's been picking up things up quickly. Right now, he will. Jeff Coat wants to rotate four or five tackles, with none of them playing more than 60% of the snaps. On the outside, LaRusa has able pass rushers and run stoppers in Derek McCartney, Tyler Hennington, Jimmy Gilbert, and Dejon Wilson. One or more needs to step up as a sack man and get Uzo Deribes four sacks per game, but preferably more. CU's 17 sacks last season were the lowest in the Pac-12, a conference whose quarterbacks need to be chased and caught on a much more regular basis. Better get busy, Buffs. Uh, just keep continue working on technique and fundamentals, and that'll help you in just understanding what you can do and uh, what you can't do against each pass protection. I'm counting on all my players. I, I'm excited about all of them. I think they've all improved from the spring. I think they uh, are uh, progressing at a good rate, and I'm really excited about this year. I've had them for uh, now two years, and all of them, uh, I can't even say one is uh, digressed. They've all progressed. I'd like to have uh, at least uh, four, but I'd like to have a six-man rotation. I'd like to have six defensive tackles ready to go and ready to uh, keep the, everyone fresh. This is BG Brooks. You can read my 2014 position previews on cubuffs.com.